out of the pageantry and romance of the most fascinating pages of history comes the glorious story of England in her most turbulent era. Surrounded by enemies from without, poisoned by treachery and conspiracy from within, a restless kingdom ruled by a lonely woman, Queen Elizabeth, absolute monarch of an expanding empire, dictating the destiny of millions, yet jealous of the heritage of the lowliest woman in her realm, the right to love, freely, completely. Look at you. Because a gentleman once glanced at you, does it entitle you to come into my presence dressed like an indecent hedge drab? Take it off, you shameless baggage. Get out of my sight. Riding into this cauldron of intrigue and danger is one of the most adventurous warriors ever to lead an army on to victory. Lord Essex, dashing knight of Elizabeth's round table, whose deeds have captured the admiration of the nation and the heart of the queen. Put your arms around me. Do you love me still? I love you always. Yes, if this were false, then I would know it now. And truly, I should die. If she were my mother's kitchen hag, toothless and wooden legs, she'd still make all the others seem pale and colorless. I tell you, she's a witch. She's got a witch's brain. I love her. I hate her. I adore her. You must go away, darling. You must never see me again. That's what I said last time I went. And here I am. You must love someone else. I'll forgive you. There'd be nothing to forgive. I'd try to love others. It's as empty as ashes. What others? Oh, no one, no one. What others? Take care. You are too popular already. My lord, you are loved better than the queen. That's your danger. What the devil's a king but a man? A queen but a woman? You talk treason and death. You dare turn your back on Elizabeth of England? You dare! I would not have taken that from the king, your father. Much less will I accept it from a king in petticoats. <laughs> 